These things are iconic, dude. Oh, wow, see? Look at that, guys. All new with tags. I paid $20 for over a thousand of these. Oh, oh. Oh, my God. 20 bucks, guys. It was not expensive. No, okay. Italy, 925, baby! What the heck is this, dude? Can you imagine that solid gold? I know, wouldn't that be nice? Oh, shoot. It says 14 freaking K. All right, we're starting today's unboxing storage, abandoned storage units in the truck because it is 100 degrees out here, literally. It's hot. And uh, we bought this amazing unit, guys. You will not believe it. I spent $20 on this storage unit. As you can see, we're at the facility right now. We're ready to unbox. I spent $20 on this unit and we made guaranteed $1,500 probably close to two thousand dollars on this unit and i can get that money tomorrow that's how awesome this unit is for 20 bucks i cannot believe we got this thing for 20 dollars either so let's show you the unit you ready Whew, it's hot. i had the ac on um we parked the truck as close as we can to the storage unit so hopefully we can get some shade because it's hot guys okay we already opened it Hey, voila! Now, if you guys have been following me on TikTok, I posted a quick video on this. You're thinking this thing is a crap storage unit. How are you gonna make two thousand dollars on this thing? But guess what, guys? These are all brand new. These are from 1980s and early 1990s, and they're all with tags made in the United States. Brand new shorts, guys. There is probably close to a thousand of them. They're all brand new. They've all got their tags and they're all from the 80s, guys. Made in the United States. The elastic is still fantastic. These right here, if I sold them for $250 each, which is kind of low, um, we're close to thousand, or excuse me, close to two thousand dollars guys, just in these. Plus, I didn't even go through any of these bags. Hopefully it's full of money, but we're gonna go through the bags, figure out what's in there as well. So what I'm gonna do is open this bad boy up. And then we're going to do box per box on the truck and show you guys what it looks like. All right, we did uh, pick up another unit or half of a unit. So don't worry, guys, that's from a different unit. You'll see that later on YouTube or you may have already seen it already. I don't know. All right, so Ashley's going to hold the camera. Um, one thing I was worried about when I did buy these is the elastic. But a lot of these are string and some of them, they're in beautiful condition, guys, which is pretty, pretty awesome. So this is the first box all brand new and you're wondering like is the elastic good on these it is fantastic guys the elastic is fantastic on these look at that so i got one box i don't know how many are here but i would say like probably 30 or 40. bunch of different sizes in here they all have their tags guys um and let's check this elastic here yeah see all of them are in fantastic condition. Look at that. Those ones are nice. Those are really cool. These are actually XL, made in the United States. And all of them are in beautiful condition. Let's see. There's probably, oh wow, see? Look at that, guys. All new with tags. Um, man, there's a lot. Oh, these are jerseys. These are jerseys. These aren't, um, I thought they're, so we got some jerseys, it looks like. Okay, these are small youth size jerseys, these ones. There you go. And then this one here, I remember, I still wear these types of shorts, guys. But all these are brand new. And they're in beautiful shape. I love the, the red on these. Look at that. Beautiful. And we got green. Look at those. Brings back memories, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's a ton of them. They're, they're just caught up in the string but look at those man elastic is funny we're gonna we're gonna do well on these okay let's see a couple more boxes i want to get in the bags too and see what's in the bags oh man look at the purple these things are iconic dude i love the purple don't you mm -hmm. i might even wear some of these purple look how many there is look at that guys there's a ton we got navy. I mean, jeez. They're all in beautiful shape. Oh my gosh, look at that. Orange. Okay, 
Let's get a couple. I mean, there may be more. I think there's double the amount that I originally thought. There's probably over a thousand of them here. So, let's see. Those are different. Ooh, these are navy. I think these are size medium. Are those shorts or shirts? I don't know. Oh, these are yeah. shorts. Shorts. They're yeah. like bike shorts. The elastic is perfect on these things. That's one thing I was worried about. Oh yeah, these are all brand new. A lot of them are in the the back. But remember, I paid twenty dollars for over a thousand of these. Like everything you see, just twenty bucks. That's it. No deposit. <laughs> so pretty insane. But yeah, look at that. Those are nice. Those are size. Uh, Okay. I don't know. Oh, I don't want them getting dirty. I don't want the white getting dirty. Look at all that. <laughs> oh, with the tag, baby. Let's see this one here. This one's got some cool greens in it. These are over 30 years old, guys. So, oh, these Those are, are jerseys. jerseys. Yeah, these are bigger jerseys. Wonder why they put them in here. You know? Just have to need extra space. Oh, look at these. What are these? These are... Those are biker shorts. Oh, these are biker shorts. I would still rock these, you know? What do you think? Oh, please don't. <laughs> I'll, I'll rock some biker oh, shorts. Oh, these are adults. You'll rock some biker, sh biker shorts? <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this. Look how many we pulled out so far. And we still have... <laughs> There may be 2,000 or 3,000 in here. I don't freaking know. All I know is there's a lot here. Holy crap. This is There's a lot more than I thought. All right, let me go ahead and uh, get this boxed up real quick because I don't want them getting dirty, especially the white ones. And we'll be right back. So after doing a little research, I'm finding that a lot of these are 84 quantities. 84. So I would say 3,000, you know, is probably what we have close to that. These are my favorite though. You can see the checkered. These are 30, over 30 years old, guys. These are my favorite, these checkered ones. Look at that. I'm gonna rock some of these. <laughs> what do you think? Oh Sexy. God. Sexy. Okay, so yeah, there's probably, uh, these, these purple are pretty nice though. If you guys want any of these, these are all brand new too in the package since 1974 um, if you guys want any of these put in the comments what size you are and I'll possibly sell it to you guys we'll see I may bulk sell these to somebody who wants to um, sell them themselves I'm not too sure yet but yeah we've got quite a bit left so what I'm gonna do is let's go ahead and we'll put these up and then we'll change things up a little bit and see what's in these uh, bags yeah. and then we'll go back to these because i know when you get further back there's different type of stuff but we'll go through some of these bags to change things up real quick once we put these back at the very top here. all right let me grab this is pretty cool huh mm -hmm. i've cool. never seen that before that guy right here the firefly yeah i wonder what they use that for <laughs> Ooh, is it here? Do you think it's here? What is it? Oh. Ooh, nice. It looks brand new. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. I don't know. It feels weird. Let's see if something else is in here. I don't know. It's, it's in there. It's brand wow. new. That's a little bonus for 20 bucks, huh? Mm -hmm. Why is this so heavy? Oh, it's got CDs. Yeah. Okay, I'll remember we don't want to give it too safe. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Okay, this is in here. This is sealed. Nice. Brand new for 20 bucks for the whole unit. I just can't believe I didn't get any opposition when we were bidding on this. Okay. Magic bullet. Magic bullet. That's nice. Okay. Okay, I already know what this is. Sheets? Yeah, it's their sheets. Not exciting. Oh. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh, bless you. Excuse me. Bless you. 
These all close. Oh, they're tags. Ooh, yeah, these are brand new. Wow. These are brand new. Nikes. This will go good. I'm, I, uh, when we do the garage sale, we'll sell a lot of this. Yeah. People love... Uh, that's a nice shirt right mm -hmm. there. Dry fit. I love dry fit. This is all Nike. Some other it's stuff. Interesting. But, yeah. You, and there's no smell to any of it. Isn't that mm -hmm. odd? Yeah. Like there's no... Uh, you buy some clothes, they get that musky smell. I've been buying units for years. Mm -hmm. It's that kind of musky smell. They don't smell bad, which makes me think they're they're definitely brand new or they're washed. Oh wow. Don't worry guys, we got garbage we, we, we brought, brought garbage, garbage bags. Garbage. Oh wow. It's just all in here. This would be great for the garage sale. Yeah it would. People are gonna love that. It's coming up. Yep, crowd sale's coming up. What do we have in here? Full box of soap. Man, you can always use those. I know, we always keep those. Things are expensive. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's cool. Whoa. That's cool. Wow. Now that is cool. It's got a marble base to it. You know, I've used a timer before with the kids. Like, like a, one of those. Uh huh. Clean your room or else. You got this much time to do this. Alright. Oh, this is heavy. I think it's books. Oh, it's records. Nice. Yeah, technically you're not supposed to stack records like this. Yeah. Um, I'll keep them in there. I don't want to go through those guys because, but those are records. Well then this may be records down here. Oh yeah, this is records. At least they put them in a bag so they don't get dusty. We'll go through a couple of them. I've never heard of them. Atlantic Star. Atlantic Star. DJ Quick. Oh, I've heard of DJ Quick. Teddy. Teddy. I know you need. Oh. I know. I know you need. Um, uh, Rodney, Rodney Franklin. Franklin. I mean, they made some good. I know jazz is expensive. Uh, some jazz is expensive. Also, you got to look out for old Christian. Some old Christian bands could be in the thousands. Really? Yeah, but I never look through records. Ask Ashley. I just yeah. sell them. <laughs> yeah. I don't mess with we them. Get, we get them in bulk. It's just we don't want to deal with yeah. them. Yeah. I don't even like like going through them, you know. Oh, whoa. Careful. Whoa. What's that? It's a thing fancy oh, whoa, whoa. lamp. Oh, did it break? No. Oh, no. That's cool. That's really cool. That's an old one, too. Wow. I thought it broke. Oh, oh. Oh my gosh. 20 bucks, guys. I was not expecting. No, that. okay, let me push That's this away. Oh my gosh. Cannot believe it. Oh, wow. those are not. Oh, those are nice, guys. Wow, look at that. Let's see if there's anything stamped. I don't see anything, but those are nice cufflings. Mm -hmm. We'll auction those off. Oh my gosh, guys. I bet wow. we find some silver in here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I bet that's silver. That is that silver, guys. I guarantee it. Does it I punish? guarantee it. And it has nine two five, baby. Nine two five, right there. See it? You probably can't, but that's silver. That's cool. That's cool. Let's see. Wow. Okay, let's 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 go through some of this. God. I... <sighs> you had no idea this was in here. <laughs> So, don't, $20? Don't. <laughs> you just thought it was jerseys. Oh, hey, the jerseys are the money, actually. This has lavender on there. Oh. I think this is silver. Yep, this is silver. I already know, guys, without even looking. I gotta, um, I left my magnet at the house. It's either at the house or I leave it in the truck. It's ridiculous. But there you go. I'll, I'll have to check on that one. Steel back. I don't know much about um, much about uh, oh, cool. that is really cool. It's 
20 bucks, guys. I know we're going to find some more silver in here. A dollar. Oh, there we got a dollar right there. Ooh, look at that. Wow, ooh, I like that yeah, one. That, that's, that is cool. That's really cool. Look at that, guys. Okay, I think this is silver right here. Oh, found another ring. That I cannot find the 925 on. It doesn't look like silver to me, so let's try this one though. Italy, 925, baby! Silver, right here. This is silver, 925 Italy. Wow. Right here, 925. Man. <laughs> That's what they do. That's what they do. Man, I got. The heck is this, dude? Can you imagine if that's solid gold? I know. Wouldn't that be nice? Let's see. It does have a marking on it? I don't know what that is. I have to. You see that? Mm -hmm. Oh shoot! It says fourteen freaking k. Where's my phone at? Hold on, guys. That would be plated though, right? No, the 14K, it would sh it would say if it's gold plated. I think this is 14K, but this is something different. Uh, um, I'm not joking, this is 14K. I'm just gonna take a picture so I can show you. So I'm, I, I had to get that tested, but. Mm-hmm, 14K. It says 14K right there. Wow. So I'm, I'm thinking that this is 14K, and it looks like gold too. This is 14K, and this is something different. But, oh my God, it's stamped right there. Oh, holy crap, dude. I gotta get this thing freaking checked out. This is also stamped 14K. And it, it, it it's not doesn't say, oh my gosh, dude. People are gonna think I'm full of crap here. Wow, look at this. Honey, look at this. Hold on. Oh, wow. 14K. Wow. It's heavy. It's really heavy. You know what? Maybe we should do the video with this in the pawn shop. Should yeah, we? Yeah, and see. You guys, I'll, I'll, thin, I'll take this to the pawn shop and I'll do a video in the pawn shop of them testing it. Let's do that. It says 14K in two places. If they allow a video. Oh, they will. They'll allow it, yeah. I, I'm good friends, so yeah, let's... We'll get that thing tested. Okay, let's show them some more. Holy crap, and it's heavy, too. Wow, can you imagine? Dude, this is sick. Okay. Whew. Here's another. This is a class ring. A lot of times, sometimes they can be silver, but a lot of times they're not class rings. Dude, I gotta get that thing checked out. I'm super pumped now. That is old looking too. And some, um, we gotta watch, some watches are, are gold too. What does that say? This is, uh, huh. some watches are gold. I don't think this is gold here, but let's see. No, I don't think so. No, it's not, that's not gold. This is stamped, but I don't know. Hmm. This may be silver here. Oh yeah, this is, I think this is 925. Let's see if I can find the marking here. Yep, 925 right there. This is silver. That's a silver ring there. That's the vintage silver ring too. It's not, that's not anything new. Ooh, gotta be careful, look at this. Razor oh, blade wow. in there. Oh, two razor blades in there. Oh my God, you got me pumped. That's not real gold. You can tell the difference, see? See the difference? Mm -hmm. This looks this looks legit and it's stamped. Ooh, that wow. is freaking huge. Oh, this is silver, guys. That's gotta be real diamonds. Right there, 925. See it? 925. It's stamped. That thing is sick. That's definitely a men's ring. Wow. That is 
is awesome. Man, we're, we're pulling out actual gold out of here. Like, isn't that crazy? This is probably gold plated. Now, this mm -hmm. is something that's probably gold plated. A lot of these are gold plated. A lot of these, um, I gotta figure out how to open it. But some of them are gold, but most of them are gold plated. Most of them are gold plated. That, oh, that's a Yankees. Wow. Oh, wow. Is this silver? You know, something like this could be silver. I'll have to get this checked out, too. Look at that, guys. That's a New York Yankees bracelet. Not to look for anything silver. Man, what time is it? Let's see, I'm trying to get to the pawn shop today. What the, what time is it, honey? 4.05. <laughs> 4.05? Okay. Maybe we can hurry and get down there today. Yeah, I can always make it tomorrow, actually. Oh, that's Sterling right there sterling this is sterling right here this is a lot of silver oh wow it's a whole thing look at that yep sterling silver it hasn't marked on there look at that okay we'll take a few pieces in uh, to the pawn shop okay what is this i don't think this is anything uh, nope, this is alloy. This is not real. It's probably the same as this. Yeah, those are not real. Let's see what else we got in here. I cannot believe it. This I don't think is real no, either. That look real. No, but let's read the clasp here just to make sure. No. Oh, this is, this is, stir, oh, no, stainless steel. Sorry, guys, we had to turn off the GoPro. It got too hot because it's 100 out here. I'm not joking. Um, so what we're going to do basically is this. I want to see if this thing is real. They close at 5 p.m., which is in basically an hour and a half. And um, it says auto exposure on the camera. Guys, give me one second, okay? Let me just make sure it's working. Okay, so it is working, although the camera's getting hot, so I got to hurry. Sorry, guys, it's like 100 out here. The GoPro is saying it's hot. So I'm going to take all this in real quick. I'm going to try to film it. This is also another 925 silver piece, by the way. This is actual silver. Um, also, I didn't know this, but the Lizard has 925 on here as well. It's 14K. Are you? This is 14K? Yep. You've got to be kidding me. It says 14K. Where? In there. Are you sure? Yeah. Give me one second. It is 14K. Oh, no, this is gold field. This this one's so that's the plated. This one's plated. That does feel really yeah. light. That feels heavy. Yeah, this this is really heavy. I, I I don't know if this is real. I mean, it's gonna be a lot of money, but I don't know. It just doesn't seem real because it's so freaking big. But yeah, that's gold plated, gold filled. Sorry. All right, so let's. Uh, I'm gonna put all this away, guys. We made already. Even if that stuff's not real gold, we made two thousand dollars on all this clothing or more. Maybe more because I didn't realize we have about 3,000 items. I thought we only had about 1,000. Um, so I'm not going to show you any more of this just because you guys, it's all the same stuff, all brand new, um, all never used from the 80s with its tags. So we're going to load up all of this. And, but there was, by the way, there was some beautiful shoes brand new in here. Um, there's a ton of them in here. So there is shoes in here, guys. Um, Oh, that one's used, but still, there's a lot of good shoes in here for the garage sale. Shoes. We got some hats in here. Obviously, they like New York. The Yankees. Oh, look at this hat. Would, you, would Ooh, you wear that hat? That's nice. I've never seen one like that before. Um, all right. So that being said, we're gonna get everything out. Next clip you see, hopefully, is in the pawn shop, letting us know that this is real 14 karat gold and not plated or filled. How about that sterling as well that's my sign we're gonna get all this checked out hopefully live on film but we gotta hurry because we're about an hour and a half away and then they close at five so we'll be right back don't go anywhere all right before we go to the pawn shop look got one more box but look how many freaking boxes there is guys and there's even more up there there is a lot of clothes here from the 80s so pretty cool anyway now the next clip's at the, the pawn shop don't go anywhere all right we're here guys at the pawn shop we're gonna go check this out along with some of the other jewelry. Um, I'm gonna try to film in here. I don't know if they're gonna be okay with it, but they should be. And uh, hopefully this is real. Honestly though, it's heavy. 
It could be real. Ashley thinks it's real. I think it's going to be copper plated gold. Still a cool piece though. Let's see what it is. All right, guys, we're at a cut above pond. This is their new location. They were, I believe, behind us or in front of us, but cut above pond here in Hillsboro. I take all my stuff over here, uh, but they've got this whole building here and they just moved in. All right, so we already have the verdict. We already have the verdict. Got my man over here, helps me out all the time. How's it right. going? Good, good. So we went through this stuff, guys. This, uh, all this is uh, gonna be costume. Now we do have the verdict with the 14 karat stamped and uh, we're gonna go ahead and magnet test it and show everybody. <laughs> Drum roll please. And it is, go ahead, I'll let you tell them. It hurts me too bad. So yeah, plated, probably copper or bronze on the inside. Yeah. I think the bale might be real. So I'm gonna do the scratch test okay. with that. Let's do that. So he's gonna acid test it right now, guys. I bought my own kit and never found out how to do it properly, so I'm not to. So always do a, just a nice long line. Okay. And I always start with tin first and okay. then move up from there. Ooh. And it's actually holding for tin, which means yeah. it's probably just a real heavy plate. Okay. But because it's magnetized, it's not solid. We'll try another one. Yeah, there's two in the 14 on it. Oh yeah, it's not eating. It's eating a little bit more on okay. the 14. But yeah, the magnet alone, that's... So so I didn't make thousands on that, guys. But we did have some uh, sterling over here. Do you mind testing uh, just for them at home if they don't know how to test silver? Yeah. Just so they... We're just gonna do... There was one that I liked. Let's get... Okay, okay let's try that guy. So that's a good sign that it is silver. Let me go get the acid okay. for that one. Drew a line over here. So remember, Cut Above Ponds here in Hillsboro. This is their new location. I I went to the other location for quite a few years, but this is going to be good, guys, because we still have a bunch of silver 925 pieces here, which is nice. Okay, this is silver acid. It's kind of dark. <laughs> yeah. So blue is good. Okay. Um, what you don't want is smoke fumes, okay. green, real bright greens, stuff like that. So that's 925. That's so that's going to be then. the 925. Okay. Nice. Okay, guys. Well, we're not millionaires, not even thousandaires. <laughs> Ashley, are you bummed? You thought it was real gold. Yeah. Yeah. I, that would probably be, how much, if that was the last question, if it was real gold, how much would it be? Let me go get a weight on it. Okay. <laughs> I'm guessing, I'm guessing 15,000. If it was real. 134 grams. Uh -huh. And let's see what melts at. 27. Mm -hmm. 67. You'd be 37 and change. Oh, wow. that That's BMW money right there. Okay. <laughs> yep. All right. Well, sad day, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Also, remember all the clothing... We're probably gonna make 16 to 2,000 on that at $2.50 a piece, because there's about 3,000 pieces. So, all right, have an amazing day. Until next time, and don't worry, I'll find a gold bar eventually, I promise you that. All right, my man, thank you. Thank you. All right, we're back at the house, guys. I ran out of room until the big garage sale, so I unboxed all these shorts, and um, I counted, there's about 2,600 of them. Um, but I wanted to do a ending to the video and see how much we make from just the shorts, not including the silver that we found. So um, there is 2,600 or so. Um, I'm asking $2 per. So $2 each is a heck of a freaking deal. Most of these are tagged, made in the United States, 1980s pieces. Um, and there is boxes and boxes of these. It's like, like like I said, about 2,600. So I'll keep you updated, guys, if we find a buyer that wants to buy all these vintage shorts. And then I'll post how much we made from this $20 unit. So you guys can get an idea of how much we're making from this unit. But uh, yeah, majority of these have tags. They're in beautiful condition and there's zero odor, guys. I mean, these things are in great shape. And the elastic on these things are fantastic, guys. Let me see if I can do this with one hand. They are fantastic. Look at that. So this is, they're really, really good shape shorts. So hopefully somebody enjoys these suckers. And I'll post an update here once we know how much we sold them all for. $2 is a piece is a steal. 
Um, it really is. I mean, so somebody that's going to get a fantastic looking, a fantastic deal over here. So anyway, I'll keep you guys updated. All right, last update. This is probably two hours after I posted the last update. We end up selling all these for $4,200, which comes out to $1.85 per piece. And uh, and then he's going to pay shipping, so probably another 300 bucks in shipping. So um, that's a heck of a deal, guys. $1.85 per shorts. You know, these things are really cool. So, uh, But $20 turned into 4000 and that's not including the silver that we found. And if that thing was real gold, that would have been 35,000. That would have been insane, right? <laughs> uh, so I, I, I surprised Ashley with, with uh, the spaghetti factory. Ashley, did you get your lasagna? No, I got ravioli. Ravioli. <laughs> anyway, so hopefully you guys like this video. I know it's completely new than what we used to do, but um, a lot of people are always like, wait, show us how much you make after. So I just thought it'd be really cool. $20 turned into 4K. So I'll put it on the screen. I'm not going to put his personal information out. He's been following me for years and he loves this stuff. So shout out to him because he got a really good deal and really cool stuff. But uh, all right, until next. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, I caught that on video. Until next uh, storage adventure, guys. Have an amazing day. Now I've got to spend the next three hours boxing all this up for him. <laughs> So there you go. See you guys.